going to do a wheel seal, let's get to it. this we have the same problem that we had on the other axle that's not good which is also the same problem I had last time I had a wheel seal go bad on this so taking the other side apart as well Here's a quick tech tip for you. If you don't have the right seal driver, take your old seal, just run the outside edge around the bench grinder, clean it up so that it can slide in here without getting stuck, and then you use your old seal as your bearing driver. But there's this that meets up with one of these holes and locks it in here. And this truck did not have these before, but it's going to have them now. This goes on over the lock ring. Lock nut goes over the top of that. Take this one down as tight as we can get it. You see we have that lock nut on there with the tab ring behind it with the ring behind that with the center holes and we have the tab bent over that keeps this lock nut from being able to back off and it'll prevent all the problems that we've had here.
Anyway, we just got back from a test drive, checked everything over, we don't have any leaks anywhere, drove smooth, no issues, so we're going to call this job done. Thank you very much for watching, and I uh, hope you like, comment, and subscribe below. Be sure to check out my other videos. Thank you. Have a great day.